Okay, so one of our jobs is to find uh, the square root of numbers that are not perfect squares, like 6 or 7. And this is a basic view of what our calculators will look like. The display screen is up here. Now, the idea is how do we do this? Well, let's try to find the square root of 6 on the calculator. To find the square root of 6, first we must press the number 6. That's one way of doing it. Press 6 right here. Then press this button right here. This little sign is like a little carrot, I call it. And then press point 5. In other words, you're doing 6 to the 1 half power. This button, the carrot button, is how you would enter an exponent into the calculator. For example, if you entered 2, this button, and then 3, that would be like saying 2 to the third power, or 8. Now we're saying 6 to the half power, 0.5 power. The half power is square root. That's one way to find a square root of a number, and you would get about 2.44. There are other ways to get the square root. You could also press second as the first button. Then press this little x squared button, because remember, Roots are the inverse of exponents. So we're doing second and then square root. It'll hit that square root sign, so press this button next. And then press 6 and enter, and you'll find the square root. Here, you can press 6, then a little carrot button, and 0.5. If you write it by hand, you'd probably see this. This is another way of saying the square root of 6. This, by definition, means the square root. So the square root of 6 is about 2.44. Another way on the calculator is to enter second, then to enter the little x squared button, then 6, and then press enter. You can determine whichever method you'd like.